I'm Roxanne. I'm a physician assistant here at West Michigan Plastic Surgery. And today we are doing lips with Rustalin Kiss, which is a beautiful product to do lips. This is Heather, and Heather has actually had her lips injected before, but we're just going to enhance her a little bit more today. Um, she has already been numbed up and we've gotten her all cleaned off. So we're gonna go ahead and inject some of the Rustalin Kiss. This is a hyaluronic acid product. Hyaluronic acid is a substance that's found naturally in our bodies. It gives our skin shape and substance. It also draws water to our skin. So they synthesize it, add lidocaine to it, and put it in the syringe. You buy the whole syringe. Now our syringes are on special sale during our event pricing coming up in December. So we're gonna go ahead and very gently just enhance Heather's lip. What we do is we put the same exact amount on the second side that we put on the first side. You doing okay? Mm -hmm. All right. So we have done her top lip and we're just going to wipe her off a little bit here. On a scale of one to 10, Heather, how bad is the pain? It doesn't hurt. Maybe like a doesn't really hurt? hurt. Mm -hmm. Okay, great. Yeah. So that's good to know because people are always concerned. Yeah. How bad is the pain? It's a small pinch. Just a pinch. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, the other concern is the pricing. Now this syringe of Rustle and Kiss is a one ml. And what that means in practical terms, it's a fifth of a teaspoon. So it's a tiny amount, but it's going to absorb 100 to 150 times its weight in water over the next two weeks. And it will maintain its stability that way. Heather and I had talked about this. She would like to see her bottom lip a little fuller than her top lip. And that's a very attractive balance. You have that bottom lip about two thirds to the one third of the top lip. And the other thing that's good to know about lips is that in my opinion, lips need to be done three or four times over a period of about a year and a half to two years before they will maintain their shape. So you would come in, get your lips done, come back in maybe four to six months, do them again, come back again in four to six months and do them again. Because we're building the shape, we're building layers in the lip. This side was slightly bigger than that side to begin with. And now we have added enough to make them more symmetrical.